Hey everyone, good evening. It is now 8 o'clock in beautiful Dallas, Texas. Um, coming to you with a small Walmart haul. We went to Walmart to get some groceries, a few items that we needed for the week. Um, and I got a couple of things. We also went to Albertson's Grocery Store, which a couple of hauls ago, I was talking about Albertson's and I said that I, didn't, I wasn't sure what it was called in other states or cities, but it is called Savon. So that is the name of it. Um, so you might have a Savon instead of an Albertson's. Also, again, they might have um, merged with Safeway. So I'm going to show you a couple of things that we got there. Henry is asleep. I'm on my bed. Henry fell asleep next to me. We were um, watching cartoons a minute ago, but now I am watching Housewives of New Jersey, and yes, you are seeing my bedroom in the flesh. So, hopefully he doesn't wake up. I'm not going to transfer him just yet, because even though it is his bedtime, I'm going to give him a few minutes to sleep get into a deep sleep. So, let's go ahead and get into it. This is from Savon. Um, they had a lot of their clearance stuff. Oh my god, I guess I must be tired. We've been out running around in this 90 degree heat all day. Like I said, it's still going to be hot here for at least another week, which is fine. I don't mind, but it, you know, it does get tiring if you've been out all day. So, anyway, they had a lot of their summer items on clearance. So, I picked up one thing and my husband picked up another. I got these sandals, these flip-flops. These have the pink and like turquoise chevron print. And this is like, what is this? Oh, what's this material? I can't think straight right now. It's like a shoelace material, whatever material that may be. But so it's kind of flimsy. So I got those. They are originally, doo -doo -doo -doo, they don't have the price. I think they were selling them for something ridiculous, like $10.99 or something. I got them for $2.99. I don't know what percentage off it was because they had the 50% off sign and then they had it like, it was a 50% off sign, but you can see where they tried to rip it off and then they had, like they tried to put another sign on top of it. Maybe somebody just didn't finish. I don't know, but they weren't 50% off. I, 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 is that 75% off? I don't know. They were two, $2.99, $2.99? They were either two or $2.99. I don't have the receipt with me, but so I decided to jump on them because I have seen them in their summer section, like all summer, and I thought they were so cute. And even living in Texas is really tricky. Like we can have you know, a 90 degree day in December. That's not uncommon. I mean, now we don't get like a long stretch of them, but it is, I mean, it can happen. It has happened and it probably will happen again. We do have days in December, January, February, where it's like, you know, 80 degrees, 85 degrees, 75 degrees, you know, typically in Texas, we get our coldest and our, um, most of our winter weather happens in like February, January, February, maybe even March. But as far as like November, December, it can be tricky. You just never know. We can have 40 degree weather one day in November and then the next day, the very next day, it's 75 degrees and sunny and no trace of cold, you know? So yeah, and I don't like wearing shoes. I don't like wearing socks and I don't like wearing shoes. Recently, I've jumped on the, excuse me, on the cute sock bandwagon, and I've started buying all the cute socks from Dollar Tree, so that has motivate me, motivated me to put socks on during the winter, because if not, I will walk around on these cold, bare wood floors, hardwood floors, all winter long. I do not care. I just don't like wearing socks. I don't like wearing shoes if I can avoid it. I walk around all day barefoot. If I have to go outside for something like in my yard, I will go barefoot. My husband gets onto me all the time. It's just the way I am. My feet are hot natured. I can't have stuff on my feet. So yeah, that's the reason I, I started buying all the cute socks because it's a motivator to put them on during the winter. He's constantly telling me, Tina, put shoes on or put socks on, put your flip flops on. It, the floor is cold. 
and even in the winter time I will walk outside with no shoes on if I have to go to the porch to the mailbox to the car in the backyard if I have to th go throw the trash out if I can avoid it I will not wear shoes so anyway I digress what I was getting at is that I can wear these all year long it does not matter I will wear them all year long and if not I will have them for next year Ugh, I talk so much let's see my husband got this uh, it's, it's a hose and for any of you that are not interested in this you can just fast forward it is a 5 8 inch by 15 feet um, and it's just a hose just your regular hose and you can attach it he got it to attach it to one that we already have to see if he can extend it this was on sale on clearance for five forty nine maybe from I want to say these were normally twelve ninety nine maybe fourteen ninety nine I don't even remember we were there so long ago like hours ago so I don't remember and I don't have the receipt so they got him he got him on clearance and they had a ton of their summer yard stuff like all the sprinkler sets and the little um, the little those little nozzles where you you attach them to your hose and then you use it as a spray nozzle they had those on clearance they had all their yard stuff on clearance like for gardening and the, the like um, all their floaties all their summer pool toys water toys all of it was on clearance um, some of it was 50% off and I think some of it was 75% off I think that's where, why I got the shoes for so cheap so we got that and then I'll go ahead and just show you this because I forgot this was in there. I went ahead and just got some cereal, these Apple Jacks and uh, Corn Pops. Those were a dollar. Okay, moving on to Walmart. We did buy a lot of stuff. We got more stuff than what I'm going to show you. But this is just the interesting stuff that I thought you might like. We've already put everything away as far as like groceries and stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and go through here real quick. Um, I just got these to have something to drink in the car to put in the water. This is the sugar-free Kool-Aid on the go. This one only had six in them. These were by the register, so I just grabbed one to have with some water. And we got some Tylenol that I am about to take right now because my head is hurting. And I'm not gonna do that just yet, so I can't get them open. I got another pumpkin waffles candle because I am impatient and I couldn't wait on the first fall like day and I went ahead and burned the one that I do have. I've been burning it all weekend and my house smells delicious. Even my husband has complimented me on the scent of our home. So hopefully this one will stay until our first fall day. We should have it maybe mid-October if not sooner. I got that. Oh, Henry's moving around. Um, this is a training toothpaste for Henry. I got some of these mainstay candle melts. These are the ones that are 93 cents. So I'm hoping that the throw is good. These are the smaller ones. So you don't get very many. Like the amount is not the same as the other ones but they were only 93 cents i was gonna buy the candles in these but i didn't remember the reviews on the candles i, I watched so many youtubers and i watched so many candle reviews and wax melt reviews that i didn't remember if the can the mainstays candles were good candles or not i have to go back and watch uh, uh spake with twang miss uh jen at spake with twang and see because she hauls or she does a lot of candle and wax melt reviews so the candles were 333 a piece the 11.5 ounce candles Those are the mid-sized ones the three wick ones these were 93 cents and I thought I wanted to buy all the scents in the candles and I thought no I'm already getting the pumpkin waffles candle so I'm gonna go ahead and just stick to these just to try the scent hopefully they have good throw so I got the pecan pumpkin cake I got two of those and then I got two of the mold cider now these 
Once I got, I kept these in the front with me because we put everything in the trunk. We were in my husband's car again because we didn't have Henry today. Um, he stayed with my mother-in-law yesterday, like he spent the night. So we didn't have Henry today. So we took my husband's car and we put everything in the trunk, but it was it was about 95 degrees today. So it's pretty, pretty hot, pretty humid. So with that being said, I didn't want to put them in the back in the trunk so I brought them with me to the front and on the way home I was smelling these I don't know the uh, what do you call it uh, like the after scent what, do you, what is it called the um, undertone the, it's got weird undertones like it kind of smells I don't know I can't put my finger on the smell but I don't know if I'm gonna like these but they were only 93 cents so Maybe I'll go exchange them. I don't know. My husband liked this one. This is another combo. This is comfy and cozy. Um, these are the dual scented wax cubes. These were two dollars. I thought I had another one. Yeah, I got one more. I was gonna get two of these, but I decided against it because I already have some in my stockpile from the last time I went to Walmart. You guys saw that haul that I did the other day. Um. This is pumpkin apple muffins. This is also a limited fall edition. This one smells really, really nice. So I got that one. That one was $2. And then the last thing I got, I saw this on Breakup to Makeup channel. And it's just to add to my coffee cup collection. Now that I have a Keurig, I think I'm so bad. And I think I'm so big and bad. And I think I'm, a, I'm part of the popular crew now. So I need new coffee cups and all of the like. Just kidding. But yeah, that's 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 kind of where I'm going with that. But anyway, these cups are ginormous. When Breakup to Makeup was showing these, they did not look this big. These things are huge. You can this is almost like a soup cup. Oh, it's backwards. I'm trying to see if it has the dimensions on it. Do, 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 do. It does not. Oh, 20, 24 ounces. 24 ounces. Wow. So maybe not coffee. Maybe I'll, I'll put coffee in it, but it's probably not going to fill up the whole cup. But yeah, it's a huge, huge cup. Um, and this just says Resting Witch Face. They had one that said Treat Yourself, like Treat, Y O, and then Self. Breakup to Makeup talked about that one, and I thought it would maybe have like candy on it, like like treat yourself like for Halloween, and it didn't. It just said treat yourself. That's all it said, and I thought, hmm, that looks plain. I wanted a Halloween theme one, so they had that one, this one, and they had another one that said pumpkin spice and chill, like Netflix and chill, but it said pumpkin spice and chill, I guess for the chill in the air for fall. And I almost got that one, but the phrase Netflix and chill is annoying to me. Like, I don't like when people say that. It is so annoying. So I thought, no, I'm going to get annoyed seeing that every single day. So I decided to go with Resting Witch Face, which most days probably could be true. Who knows? Depending on who you are, who knows? So I got that. This was $2.48. Um, so yeah, that is all of my haul I'm gonna put these things away hopefully these have good throw I mean this one maybe I'll try one and then if I don't like it I'll exchange the other one but I'm really excited to start getting into these fall scents I cannot wait this one is kind of a fall scent too it's I mean it can be transitional you can probably use it year-round but I think it's more of a fall scent it's musky it's, it's, this one's kind of sweet, but this one's really musky. So I think the combination of them is probably going to be more on the musky side. I am a musky fanatic. I like cologne scents. So anyway, look at my little guy. His little thosey thos. He's so cute. This boy is growing so fast. I can't believe he's already a year old. But anyway, I will let you guys go. I hope you guys have a fantastic week if I don't see you guys um, on any of my videos. I do have the, um, the, 
my god, I can't talk. The tubal ligation video, and I probably 